Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back to InfoFlow, Blazers. Today is Thursday, September 26th. I'm Howard. And I'm Eamon. Former Montgomery County Executive Isaiah Leggett and his wife Catherine celebrated the opening of the new $104 million math and science building at the Tacoma Park Silver Spring campus of Montgomery College on Thursday, September 19th. A hurricane watch has been issued for parts of Mexico and Cuba and the Category 3 hurricane, given the name Hurricane Helen, is expected to hit the Gulf Coast of the United States today, primarily north and west Florida. The hurricane is expected to bring flash flooding and heavy winds and rains into these areas of the United States. For today's Hispanic Heritage Month fact, Dr. Ellen Ochoa was the first Hispanic American woman to fly into space in 1993. Dr. Ochoa spent nearly 1,000 hours in space over the course of four flights. After retiring as an astronaut, Dr. Ochoa became the first Hispanic director and second female director of NASA's Johnson Space Center in Houston, Texas. Today's Spanish vocab word is otoño, meaning autumn in English. According to our poll of the day, 39% of blazers say evening is their favorite time of the day, 33% say night, 21% say afternoon, and 7% say morning. To participate in our daily polls and weekly trivia, follow us on Instagram at bnc underscore Blair. I'm sure most of us got stuck in the throng of students at, on Blair Boulevard during the club fair, so let's get a special report on it from our PAX team. Hey Blazers! On Thursday, September 19th, Blair held its annual club fair. Let's go check out some of the clubs and see what Blazers think. I think people should join our club because film is a art form. Really great opportunity to like connect with the community and just kind of give back. We sing a cappella songs together, it's a ton of fun. We, it's just like arts and crafts and we make them, we have a theme every week and it's really fun, it's really chill. We do all the behind the scenes work, we do sound, lights, carpentry, paints, props, wardrobe, just like anything you can think of. We make 3D horror games. We make um, platformer games. Try to be a good place for artists to grow. There's going to be some script writing lessons. Really, it's more about like stu empowering student voices, that kind of thing. If you have any interest in history, you want to you know, be with people who are good at history, good at trivia. We have a variety of improv games, short scenes. You'll be helping people while doing fun things like crafting. We kind of just like want to bring the Hispanic community closer together. It's due to any person who wants to join. There are so many different subject areas that it kind of molds to whatever your personality is. And you get to meet so many Cool we'll have snacks too. <laughs> we have candy. A lot of food and snacks. We're entirely student run, so everything we do, we do ourselves. It has so, so many departments that, like, no matter what you're interested in, there's something to do. It allows a bunch of clubs to be in one hallway, and so people could look around, see what they want to join. But a lot of people that I just like don't know that pulled up, and we're like, yo, this is cool. I'm gonna come. I'm like overheating. <laughs> So, maybe a little bit bigger space. I, I tried to walk through the halls and I almost got trampled, bro. I swear to God. Even though it's like backed up, people kind of are like forced to look at your glove and like, and then they like find out that like, oh, like this is so cool. I would have never actually like thought to do this club before. That was only a few of Blair's many clubs. Be sure to go check out the rest of them on the MBHS website. See you next time, Blazers. Go Club Fair. Yeah, 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 yeah. The student body has really outdone themselves this year with the amount of clubs and the sheer size of that crowd. Have you joined any clubs this year, Eamon? Yeah, I have actually. Shout out to Plate Forward Blair. How about you, Howard? No. Just the Lonely Man Club, huh? And now, let's go see how much cooler we are than Springbrook by watching them lose at soccer. Hi, Blazers. It's Wednesday, September 18th, and we're here at Springbrook for the boys' varsity soccer game. Let's see how they do. I think we did a great job in just keeping calm and playing our game and controlling it because sometimes we can get a little carried away and try and force the ball over the top. And we did a really good job, as you could have seen, with just possession and holding the ball the entire game. Say my second goal was my favorite play. I think we started off the first half kind of slow, but we definitely picked it up in the second half. 
the same thing you said. We didn't play the game that we're normally used to playing in our first half. It took us a while to get into the game, and then we put eight in the goal, so. So I think a lot of people did a lot of, a lot of good things today, so I'm glad we have a lot of depth. My favorite player was definitely Caleb Elazar scoring his first goal of the season. Can you tell us about your performance tonight? Um, I was late. Yeah. Hey, Lynn Blazers, make sure to congratulate these soccer players when you see them in the hallways and show up to their next home game on September 25th against BCC. It was only right to play that, that, this pack during Spirit Week, right? We're excited to see more victories in the future. Are you ready to showcase your bilingual skills? On October 16th, Blair will be holding a seal of biliteracy testing exclusively for seniors in the auditorium at 7.25 a.m. This is your chance to earn the prestigious honor that recognizes proficiency in two or more languages. Make sure to sign up and secure your future opportunities in education and the workforce with this respected achievement. For registration, Use the QR codes that appear on our posters throughout the school. Or for more information, stop by the World Languages Office Room 170 and speak with Mrs. Gonzalez. Don't miss out, seniors. And that's all for today's show. Check out our website at bncaonline.net to submit any announcements and follow us at bnc underscore Blair on Instagram and bncblair on TikTok and Twitter. Have a thunderous Thursday, and we'll see you next time, Blazers.